Hey guys, welcome to my channel, and today we're with the twins, they're asleep, and I'm about to leave soon. The cutest little things, guys, they are too cute and adorable. They play hard and sleep hard, that's my babies, I love my niece and nephew. Okay, guys, I did not touch my hair, but I'm on my way to Marshall's to get my dad something for his birthday. I wait till last minute, and I never should, but he's a man that has everything. When I say everything, he has everything. God has really blessed him and my mom. We came from not everything. <laughs> you know, I know a lot of people have the same story, but um, God is a way maker you know he is a way maker and my parents they live to tell he turned 63 today and he let me put on my seatbelt gotta put on the seatbelt forgot about that but he is here to live to tell you know my parents been through so much but i am so happy what god is doing in their lives you know been they've been married for now 40 going on 47 years and they had my sister when they were 16 and they're like the little love story but um from high school you know they went to school with each other in elementary school let me turn it off they went to school with each other in elementary school and so they end up let me open the window a little bit. They end up dating. They were best friends first. And they both came from big families. But they end up finding God when my mom was like 23. And from that day on, they lived for God, you know. Of course, they went through things, you know, because the flesh is never, you know, you got to kill die the flesh every day you gotta die the flesh to every every morning you wake up you gotta renew your mind in the word um that is what my parents i'm a living testament because i watched you you know your kids watch you and i watched my parents and they lived the life that they were supposed to live so yeah it's been a blessing watching them grow and die and and being along with them because now now i'm saved I got saved when I was 20 and well really 18 but I didn't start living living for God you know reading my word and developing a relationship with him until 20 and then even then I had a lot of work to do so if you're just beginning in God or you want to know more about God just pick up the word you know and just go to Ephesians, go, he will tell you, and even now, you know, you can go online and type in, what is salvation? How do you get to know Christ? How did God come into your heart? But, yep. So I'm almost to the store, guys. And my dad, he teaches now, and he teaches my family on Wednesdays. You know, we have Bible study. And my husband, he's grown in God just as well as me. And we're just, you know, making sure that we get in the Word. Because that's what makes a marriage. That's what makes you a good dad, a good mom. And live for Him. And be happy. You know, for so long I wasn't happy. But I'm happy. I, I, I love God with all my heart. And I'm proud of my dad how he grew in the spirit you know but it's awesome when you you have you see me turning it's awesome when you can see you, you see somebody is about to hit me <laughs> but it's awesome when you can see your parents grow and you can grow along, right along with them but love you guys, and I'll see you on the next video or clip. I got my wallet. It's nice. 
There's so many things I'm getting from my dad. Okay, now I'm at the pharmacy getting my medicine, and then I'm gonna head home. So thank you for oh, watching, okay. guys. Bye -bye. See ya.